Wednesday, Information, Communication and Technology Cabinet Secretary Fred Matiangi, his foreign affairs counterpart Amina Mohammed, and Criminal Investigation Department Director Degwe Muhoro visit a house in Runda Estate, Nairobi, which is under police surveillance. The media is locked out as the three enter the house which 36 Chinese nationals were arrested on Sunday night and later arraigned in court Tuesday. When they emerged, they stated that the 36 who are illegally in the country were operating sophisticated gadgets used for hacking into computer networks. What has been going on here uh, is actually a cyber command center uh, and a huge uh, criminal gang that is uh, uh, running um, a cyber crime framework here. Sentiments echoed by Foreign Affairs Cabinet Secretary Amina Mohammed. They do not choose who to, uh, to, uh, to injure or hurt. Uh, so if it was a terrorist uh, command center, then it doesn't matter whether you list the house to them. You could probably be one of the victims. In the same case as if it were a command center for some cyber uh, criminal activity, uh, it's your bank account, hmm? it's your information. You applied for custodial. Uh, orders uh, before from the court uh, to allow us uh, investigate uh, this matter. The house was raided by security officers following a fire incident Sunday where they stumbled on what could be a cyber crime syndicate in a country where cyber crime is on the rise amid concerns that many financial institutions lack the capacity to stop cyber criminals and protect accounts held by their customers. Judicus Gay, Citizen Business Center.